You'll hear an assignment to you soon. Have a lot of time. I'll do it later. Procrastination is said to be a constant war in a brain between the limbic system and the prefrontal cortex. The limbic system is just like a city interconnected with the roads of emotions, memories and motivation. Imagine the components of limbic system as the branches of the brain, hypothalamus, thalamus, amygdala, nucleus accumbens and hippocampus all teaming up to tackle procrastination. We're going to focus on the strongest avenger, the nucleus accumbens. It creates a link between the motivation and actions aka the limbic system and the prefrontal cortex. It receives a dopaminergic reaction from the ventral tegmental area and is highly involved in the release of dopamine. Think it as a monster energy drink, a powerful boost that fuels your motivation, rewards you for achieving goal and give you that extra push to keep going. Also, both nucleus accumbens and the prefrontal cortex lead to procrastination. The prefrontal cortex is a newer part of brain which is responsible for executive functions such as impulse control, decision making and planning. It receives a signal from the nucleus accumbens. So, if the nucleus accumbens tell that the limbic is saying no dopamine by doing homework, it will not move a hand. But the prefrontal cortex does not believe the nucleus accumbens and think of a big picture and has a control over it. However, if the prefrontal cortex is not working well or functioning well, then the limbic system will win and get away with the homework without regulations. Now, you know you can reduce procrastination by strengthening your prefrontal cortex.